YouTube, 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 never fear, Logan Jays here, back with another sneaker review. Today I bring you a pickup that I was able to hit through online raffle on Kith's new app. They updated the app and Ronnie celebrating the new balance and Kith's 10 year anniversary. Started out on his birthday, June 15th. 2022 for his 40th birthday and they were first shown in the lookbook last year 2021 somehow I don't know if it was a delay but or this was the whole plan all along as uh, he did release a new balance I believe it was 10 years ago with the 999 steel blue on his birthday as well so this is nothing new as uh, Ronnie's not new to this either, so you know, it's a lot of hype with uh, Amy Leon Dore and Teddy Stannis, but Ronnie's been doing it longer. If you're new to this, now you know. But um, yeah, I thought uh, I unboxed it, I picked it up, uh, and um, not from in store, I just picked it up. Uh, I thought I was getting the 990. V1 as I hit on those two reviews should be coming soon and I opened the box and I'm like what's this the tracking told me I was getting the 99 uh, V1 990 V1s so I'm like okay and uh, you know here's the box I'm loving it man look at this box fire let you know what's in the box Got that kith print throughout, white and orange. Now, Cyclades is a spot in Greece that Ronnie got the inspiration to do the sneaker. And he did a 997.5 years ago. Uh, I like the 997, it is um, my favorite silver web New Balance. And for whatever reason, I felt like, nah, I'm good. Uh, even though I love the colorway, I just felt, um, I wish it was a 997, you know, more of a purist or whatever you want to call me. Uh, not that I don't like it, I just, I don't know, I felt some type of way and I was like, and I was too making any excuse not to purchase certain things. So I was like, yeah, I like it, but I still do that. Even though I like something, I'll still try to come up with something to not buy, you know give an excuse and then sometimes you know fall and uh, cop but for the most part uh, I love these always have and um, love how the colors pop show you the tag here M990 KC2 and in the insoles you can see you know the whole inspiration and stuff has the Pegasus and everything as the other uh, pairs that he released last year it was the 1300 RC's it was three colorways and you know that had the Pegasus come with there's a stance socks I'm just looking I don't know what that snake and little things going on probably like some warning or something I don't know but uh, yeah, it came with additional set of socks. So it's like a white, green, and like a cream looking color. And I'm unboxing it, you know, so you can see my reaction. Comes with a dust bag. I like it. Sneakers on it. And the back of the box, just because I just noticed that, you can see the imprint on that. Look at that, man. Oh, show. Got the additional sets of laces. You got your gray and your white. A little rubber band action going on there. Comes like this. And you can see, you see I'm in camera. Ooh, hoo, hoo, baby. Look at these. Woo! 
<laughs> wow. Look at both of them really quick. Normally, I don't overlook them um, on camera, but I will right now. Give me one second. Yeah. Uh, what's this? I, I see something on the heel. Don't know if you able to see that. A little scuff action going on there. Some glue. Don't know if you'll be able to see that little thing on the heel there. Trying to pull it off, but not care about it too much. Let's see. Maybe you see it now. It's like coming off over here. I don't know what's going on. Some fibers and stuff. Nothing crazy. But all in all, oof, that orange, man. That gray. I see some orange suede rubbing off on the end so just beware i think that's probably what it is is some of that suede rubbing off and going all over the sneaker you know buyer beware premium leather wow i just reviewed a pair of uh 990 v2s of nine pair and that was part of the Teddy Stannis, the sea salt colorway. So you got your, what looks to be like, I'm trying to make sure it doesn't look as white as here. I don't know if you'll be able to see that. See, this is white and there's another, call it white, white rubber outsole there. You got your little plastic hit right there with the N, New Balance absorb on the midsole this is white towards the front and then you got a different looking white it's more of like a little bit of an off white it's two shades of white there towards the heel your absorb technology cushioning is white there heel counters white as well i love the little ridges and stuff Love the shape of these. You got your orange suede premium feeling perforated in the vamp area. Move this out the way. Wow. You got this, I would call it like a tan suede. Same thing. A little less premium than the one on the mud guard. It's just different grades of the suede. Everything feels good though. It feels nice and soft. I'm guessing the color that they wanted came out with this effect or whatever. And you have a white end. And this feels like if it's, if it's a reflective uh, end right there. Same as in the medial. You have gray perforations here. Suede as well. You have this hit of leather and that tan look you got this like green teal looking color on the heel and you have yeah let me get that angle you got that kiss damn i'm trying to like see it as well you got that kiss and like a silver metallic silver and the eye is changed to an x to celebrate the 10 year anniversary of kiss store and this feels like it's a reflective 3m as well as the heel as well here top of the collar here you have your gray suede tongue starting off from the u throat you have your 990 new balance made in the usa and you're embroidered on n as well and the suede is premium just like over here just doesn't have perforation so you got little perforation throughout so the vamp and towards the heel and just one little piece of leather there your sock liner is white when were these made um, basically the end of january it says 2204 so fourth week of uh 
2022. These have two different insoles. Let me just take them out. So, this is the one here. Let's take out the other. They both them. So they connect together. That's that spot you want to hit up and go to Greece there. Ronnie's letting you know, go. It's the same on this one. Just want to make sure the dates, just wondering this all. And if you want to see how it's looking, you see, man, the laces are in the way. See the suede being folded over and everything? Just anybody wondering. got your like tannish laces that are in here already so fire sneaker Ronnie man uh, one thing I will say uh, about the um, the 990 V2 when you're doing this um, color block I wish that he would have like altered it and had it like clean like this mud guard come all the way back up to here to give it a cleaner look but I get it you know as far as to keeping the purest happy and stuff and that's the effect that you can get and stuff but other than that that's the only thing you know um, I really like these I can't believe I hit you know um, I'm guessing you know he made a decent amount of pairs uh, I thought for sure I was gonna hit on the one I really wanted and I didn't so and but I get it as that one seems to be the most favorited one um, the 990 V4 as he wore those in the promo pictures with his daughter and his father so um, I wanted those the most as I had that colorway in the 997 he actually gave me a loyalty access when I was able to get that pair so if it wasn't for that I wouldn't have done uh, retail because you know it, it's hard to cop off kith um, especially over the years the more and more uh, hype it's gotten and if you don't make a lot more pairs you know it, it's just gonna be almost impossible now he does take care of the locals but I'm not one to go try to pick up sneakers in store unless you know it's worth to going you know like you know if it's ultra limited um because you gotta like pay for parking tolls deal with traffic in new york city man you know shout out to everybody that lives over there and you know that that's used to that not me i live in jersey i like it chill even though we get some traffic here and there but new york's a different thing man it's crazy so but um happy blessed to have these Whew. great job ronnie happy birthday once again oh got your little tag here if i didn't say um yeah no the the box usually has the um the whole made in the u.s but this is a special box if there's anything else in here no it's just a foldable one too everybody wondering what's here that's it youtube i hope you enjoyed the review and I'll be um, bringing some more of these um, Kith Anniversary sneakers. Just be on the lookout for them as I was surprised as I got, you know, notification for a different sneaker, the Dusty Rose, um, that was coming and I ended up getting this one. So, but um, yeah, you too. Uh, I'm happy right now and, uh, and I'm signing out. Peace!